Hello, everyone. Thank you very much for joining me today. Today is Tuesday, uh, September 6th. And today I was talk, uh, thinking about this topic this morning of just being happy, just being happy. I mean, I won't keep it too long today because this, uh, you know, this is all relative to your life and things going on. But I want to give you some kind of ideas and things to keep in mind that I do when I'm getting a bad mood or things are not going the way perfectly the way I want. I mean, we all have those good days, bad days, but good hours, bad hours, no matter where we are in our lives the best it's ever been or the worst it's ever been, we still get in these moods of and deciding if we're going to be happy or not, you know? So it's all really, when you cut it down and anything I've read, anything I do, anything I follow, everything I believe in is, is just a choice to be happy, just to be happy, just to be happy in the moment, you know, you could be happy uh, about just little things that are happening. Because I know it's those little things that get us in those bad moods and makes us not happy. Because there's people out there whose lives in general, they're just not living their best life and they know it, but they still find happiness with their day-to-day -day things. And there's people out there that their whole lives in general, are should be happy. Everything's going the way they should be going. But then they pick those days, those times, something gets them upset and they're not happy because they choose at that moment not to be happy. So I always do the kind of the mental things to get me out of that funk sometimes of thinking. E example is that if you were on a desert island and uh, no water, no food, what would make you happy? The bare bone minimums of shelter, uh, food, water, <laughs> just the bare minimums go, all I need is this to be happy. If your life was in total uh, shambles, like let's say just financially, there's people out there that just would be happy with just paying all their bills every month. Just, I wish I just had enough money to pay all my bills and eat and survive. When there's people out there that are not happy and they, they have no worry every day, every month of just paying their bills. But for, for some reason, financially, they're not happy because they want more. And there might have been times in your life where you're just, I just wanted to be stable with that. So you make that choice. You just make that choice in that moment, decide if I'm going to be happy or if I'm not going to be happy. And think of those people, think of those situations that you've been in your life where you wanted less to be happy. Does that make sense? Especially uh, health-wise, there's people out there and if, it, and if you're going through it, I'm, I, I'm sorry for you if you have any health issues that it's out of your control and you go, gosh, I just would be happy if this, if I could just be a little healthier or if just this didn't hurt as much or I could be more mobile, whatever, what is, do I be, would I be happy? Because I know me, let's just say health-wise, I see people people I love, family, friends, that their health is even close to mine. And sometimes like when I get a cold, I'm in a, a, a bad mood for, for the whole time I have the cold. I'm like, I just have a cold that's going to go away in a few days. Why can't I be happy that I just have a cold? <laughs> or you hurt yourself. You're like, oh, I just did something and you're upset. You know, yeah, there's days I, I'm getting older, getting out of bed. I'm like, oh, my back hurts for the day. And I, I might be not in the greatest mood because my back hurts. But I know it's going to go away in a little bit because it's just something the way I slept or something like that, where other people have illnesses and things out there. So it's all by making the choice of being happy. And anybody watching this video, Anybody watching this video that has the time to watch this video, the technology 
the cell phone or video or laptop to watch this video and and in, is even interested to even watch my video because there's so much other things that go on. You probably, if you're watching my video, you're reading other news or reading other articles. I, I don't think this is the only thing that you're watching <laughs> today. You have the time, you have the financial means and to have the, 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 um, the technology and the ability to pick up something and touch something. There's people out there that, that can't watch things or do things without help. And they might not even have the people around them to help them. So they're, they're, they're not, they're, they're stuck watching whatever they They don't get a choice in life uh, as often as some of us do. So I, I don't know if that was clear, but I feel that anybody watching my video right now has something to be happy about as an opportunity, as the finance, has the ability to do something or make the choice to be happy no matter what else is going on in their lives. There's something positive happening or something that they're do you're doing now that a lot of people would love and would be happy to be able to do it. Just watch some a video and have the technology in their hand to do it uh, on that. So think about that. It's all relative to the what you're looking at. It's all situational, but you can make the choices more oftentimes than you think to go, I'm just going to be happy and not be in a bad mood, not be sad and not have, uh, I feel, and this is just my opinion, I feel like we do ethically a disservice. I don't know if that's, if that's the right term to use to people that don't have these opportunities like we have every day. Some days when, you know, I don't feel like going to the gym. I'm like, I, I feel obligated to go to the gym because my body is fit enough. It is, it is, uh, healthy enough and pain free enough to go do that. And people would love, they wish for that. They wish for the situations I'm in. And there's people out there that wish they were in situations like that. If they would be, if they would switch places with you today, they'd be the happiest people in the world. So why aren't we the happiest people in the world with our situation that we're in now when there's so many people that if we switch places right now, they'd be the happiest people on the planet, no matter what situation you're in now. So think about that. And I do that with myself as often as I think I need to when I'm not feeling the happiest <laughs> when I should. So hopefully that gives you something to think about. Hopefully that made a little bit of sense to you. And, and I appreciate you watching and listening to uh, my videos in this video today. So have a great Tuesday. Hope everybody's doing well and happier today, especially after this video. And we'll see you tomorrow, Wednesday. Bye-bye.